This is lesson 36 in our basic JavaScript section of Free Code Camp. This lesson, titled Word Blanks, says we will now use our knowledge of strings to build a Mad Libs style word game we're calling Word Blanks. You'll create an optionally humorous fill in the blank style sentence. You'll need to use string operators to build a new string result using the provided variables my noun, my adjective, my verb and my adverb. You also need to use additional strings which will not change and must be in between all of your provided words. The output should be a complete sentence. We've provided a framework for testing your results with different words. The test will run your function with several different inputs to make sure all of the provided words appear in the output as well as your extra strings. So pretty much we could just focus on this. This function takes in these parameters, my noun, my adjective, my verb, my adverb. Down here, when we call our function, these words are going to be plugged into dog will be in my noun, big will be in my adjective, ran will be in my verb, and quickly will be my adverb. They want us to make a sentence so that when these when this function is called, it's plugged into that sentence we create. So let me see if I have kind of an idea. We could say result is equal to, and you could say a uh, string my, and then we put a space here because, or else they won't know we want a space. We could say something like it's a. Uh, Instead of big, we could say, or replace that with my adjective, because they could pass in anything here. So my, let's just say it's big, my big, then we could say this my noun, so we could say my, so we do got to put the space, because we're going to want there to be a space there, and then we could do plus, and we here it's going to pass in dog, so we would do my noun. So right now it would say my big dog. And we would do double quotes again. My big dog can. And then our concatenation operator plus operator. So my big dog can, <clears throat> my verb, oops, my verb, space, and do that because we need a space. So ran space concatenate, oops, and then my add a verb and then put a period. So this should actually now contain when this function is called and they pass this in. We could actually pass in whatever we want here and it'll print it out in that way. My big because my adjective would have big space my noun which would be dog my big dog can and then my verb would be ran, even though that doesn't make sense. But what can we do? So say my big dog can ran. I can just erase this actually. Let's see what this does. Well, I still need a space, so put it there and then there. Okay, so this should say my big dog ran quickly. And that should actually satisfy this challenge. Oh, semicolon. When it returns result, it's going to return my big dog ran quickly. So that's it for this lesson.